I am back and with some more State of Decay 2 and with another episode for the CRM, we're on episode 20 and more or less continue on from last episode um, where well, we pretty much just cleared up, um, I suppose it's the downtown area, um, Province Ridge, where we want to move to one of the larger red bases at some point. Um, I tried to recruit Red Talon soldiers but they weren't what we're looking for. I want demolitions for making C4. Um, and yeah, it was quite chill, quite nice. Um, good time, time as always. I was trying to cure one of our neighbours, but she wasn't showing up. So I'm kind of thinking, hopefully, by the time... Because like, I've loaded out and loaded back in. Hopefully she's there. Because um, it was kind of weird. Like, she wasn't there. Like, her role outpost was kind of dead like there was no items inside the outpost um and it was her on her own as well um naomi so maybe we're ready to get started on that still there's free booze in it for you if you can help let's maybe. do it okay i'll be there shortly Let's talk to our people. That's almost too good to be true. Let it be true. <laughs> Phoenix is an alky. Come on, princess. I thought you'd be fun. I didn't want to hear that. Princess, you're you meant to be the fun one in the group. Phoenix is the one that's gonna be a bit strict. I'm gonna take the play play cure just in case. But she pops up with that mission again. Ugh, hair tastes like blood soup. Might be worth checking if she's there. Because like she wasn't there at all, like uh, like the whole out her whole it was her on her own, but she wasn't there. I want to just check. Oh, here we are. Like, yeah, this is already lit up better. Oh, yeah, like, it, hey, none of this on. was here, like... Oh, she's not got plague in or anything. Uh, like, she's on her own. I kind of feel bad for her. I would recruit her, like, let me just double check how many people you can recruit before it fills up, like, if it's nine, that means we've got two f slots to fill, and we could pr still recruit, I kind of feel bad for her living here on her own, it's kind of sad, she'd probably be better off here though, <laughs> she'll only end up getting killed, let me just check, Oh my god, my Google search is just Mass Effect, Mass Effect. <laughs> what the fuck? Um, how many can you have some news to share? Root. In state. See, I would know this half by heart, but no, I've got a brain like a sieve. Uh, if you want to go for it, ah, uh, eight people. That sucks. Mm. So the game may throw this quest line your way, but. Because you can get more, but you've got to do it in a, a weird way, like... Mm. Yeah, I would recruit her, but it's like she's got auto mechanics that I don't need that. Because Judith already has that skill. Um, 
or the skill we need anyway. Well, what we wanted. But. Uh, I, I don't know. Because I don't want to be stood with eight people and one of them I don't really need. Like, I, it really it doesn't help um, Carl's case, like this guy, because he's got music. It, it's good for morale, I guess, and stuff, but I, w I do prefer skills that I can actually use to craft stuff. <laughs> I kind of feel sad for her because she's on her own. <laughs> I don't know what happened to it, happened to the rest of her group though. Like, the fact that she's on her own, like she used to have two people with her. She might have killed them. Maybe I'm everything. Maybe she wants to be alone. She might have killed her friends. She might have been fed up with them bumping into her all the time. Because that's what AIs do. They just bump into each other all the time. Set up a still here. Plenty of room. Oh, I'm chilling out, are you, mate? What are you doing up there? You're acting like a child, mate. You wanna get down? What are you up there for? <laughs> I'm gonna come up. How do you even get up there? It's impossible. <laughs> Alright, mate. Okay. I'm glad you showed up. Really put a few things to the still. Hey, a beer in the morning is the best oh, no. way to survive the apocalypse, don't you think? Oh, uh, don't know. Nah, but you gonna come or are you stuck up there? How the fuck did it give it, like, you got, like, that's what I mean, like, the game does need some TLC. <laughs> Fucking A! No, I can go and do it on my own, mate. I don't need your own. But if he's not gonna come in and do this... Okay. Like, we're not gonna fail the mission because we're driving away from him, right? Some weird people in this world. Well, the worrying thing is, I can't climb up there, so how the fuck you went up there? I don't know. Some Spider Man. Some freak just standing in a dark warehouse. On top of a. He's not exactly getting <laughs> sight lines of anything, is he? Are you okay? Did you get bit by a plague zombie? <laughs> Not unless plague zombie is a brand of beer. <laughs> <laughs> I have to rest. How do you avoid you need rest so soon? I thought he. I, no, how did he not get burned? From that? Fuck up the magnet. Oh shit. Well, that's the last up. No! Oh no, fuck! Ah, oh, I ain't gonna do zombies magnets. Fire the hole! Where the hell did these come from? Now I ain't gonna fucking ah. Stop lunging at me! Where the fuck these come from? Time to reload. Fuck you. 
So slow now. Hey, look, I hate that lunge, man. It's stupid. Come on. Now I've got up here, they're gonna just start making noise. No point to it. Oh, got rid of them. Oh, they're coming here. Good, good, good. Get some help. Assholes. Where's your buddies? And they're gonna die. The magnets. <laughs> Come on. I swear the zombies weren't this sticky before. Like, Jesus. Take your time then. Why are you dying on me? Come on. Where's your buddies? Damn, and these zombies need to stop. Jesus Christ. That was way too much work. Thanks. Fucking piss head. That was way too much work. I see what I mean, like they were lunging every five seconds and sticking to you too much. <laughs> ask and Probably just me, ask but. And ye shall receive. I feel like the fight wasn't this slow before. Is it? I know that this guy's really like back to basics sort of thing, but man, I feel like he's at a disadvantage. Sayonara. You get your shit together. I thought they wanted to move here. Well, everything seems calm here. I guess this trip was worth it after all. Hmm. That fight was stress like it's like maybe they're just trying to make the fights more stress trust stressful maybe, but um so I don't know why, but it feels like I don't know it feels like you can't take your time on the fights anymore. Because the zombies are just lunging at you all the time. You can't just like somewhat take your time to do the attacks because they're always on you and I don't feel like it felt like that before. Oh, this feels like a new thing, like a change to combat. Like you guys always have bread, like it doesn't have Carl like, and Judith. Like, as soon as they start carrying anything, they're kind of screwed. That's why I need a light backpack. For now. I took the meds last time. No, I think they can fuck off. <laughs> they could honestly fuck off. Even though I've got plenty of food, I suppose. Got a bit.
I really must have got the new beast set up. We'll be putting the time in to fix it all up and everything. <clears throat> I did want to move today, but it all depends on who we recruit from Red Talon. So if we get our um, demolition, we'll be moving. See, I suppose. I hate to ask, but we could use a little help over here. We got the cure, let's give it a Unless we kill her. Alright, shall we low zombies to get her killed? There's an option. Put her out of her misery. Put her out of her misery. She's alone, she ain't got nothing. She ain't even got any weapons on her, Paul. I think. Um. Thanks a bunch. Take care of yourself. Got some good stuff on her though. Not going far with all this. She ain't doing that bad. Like she got some molotovs. And I'm gonna take them. <laughs> um, let me take the building materials. All right. Someone to trade to, I suppose. Take out the nearest plague heart, it might just clear up. Drop off successful. Serious running trader. And be pretty good to check out because you've got quite a bit of influence. Um, I, unless I can. How's the daybreak? We need new blood around here, and we think Red Talon's the right place to look for it. What do you say? I heard you needed some help. Well, I'm on the job. We'll be with you in a front minute, friend. Demolition is what we want. Need to deal with that infestation as well. Yeah, we need to still keep up the practice of keeping the stations down. Because when they start being turned up, we are gonna need to deal with it. Oh, that's kinda cool, that little like that. I ain't seen that old post yet. Kinda neat. I love the Christmas lights that they've got in the game now. It's better than like candles and shit like that. Hey there! Oh, the is great. Let's see, learn. Demolitions, that's what we need, boy. Must be wrong because I actually Mario! Like <laughs> Thanks. <laughs> You're gonna recruit Mario. <laughs> oh, come on then, Mario. Uh, thanks for the responding so quickly. I'll take you to our base. Demolitions. And that's it, I suppose. Another good recruit. Make C4 now. Which was the main thing. Um, 
Maybe we're going to clear that. Knock, knock. Maybe we're going to clear out that. Yeah. Infestation out, and then we'll go. Good to have you on the team. Sure. Come on, man. Run, run, run. Why ain't you running? Come on. Why aren't you tired? You're the laziest guy I know in this group. Right. And the easy use on his weapon's pretty good as well. A weapon. <laughs> easy, easy use on a gun, that's stupid, isn't it? Boy, stupid. So, Mario. Tell me about yourself. Demolition, zombie threat plus, beds used. Oh, you're great, ain't you? Um, yeah, pretty good. Really, the they should make their standing reward higher. Because standing is what makes the game harder. And... Oh, he's got a ton of C4 already. That's great. It's <laughs> good. Okay, anyone we want. Uh. I'm on my last mag here. <laughs> that silencer ain't gonna make much difference on this gun, but that ain't nothing. What am I like to sort of shotgun for him? A sidearm burst. I ain't got many sidearms really. Put a pilot hat. Um, let's put a pilot hat on, helmet on. Because CRM are known for flying their helicopters and showing off. We've got a helicopter around the back, I promise. I've seen a model for State of the K2 where people are flying around in a helicopter. It's not exactly the smoothest thing I've ever seen, but it's pretty solid for what it's worth. I. Stuff people can mod into games is crazy. My modders should have more of a job in game development. I, um, I think the Rockstar is known for um, hiring modders. It's, sh they should, because like some of the mods, they, like, if you're able to create mods and you do a good job of it, like, you should have a guaranteed job <laughs> in game development, really. But the thing is, like, I suppose game development, as soon as you get into that field, the creativity you had is probably gone. Because um, you've got you've got to stick to limitations and you got to work as a team. <laughs> I suppose if you're a modder, you're used to working on your own and just creating what you want to do. And when you're a modder, you don't necessarily have to worry about copyright or anything, because you just do it, don't you? Off the record. Um... Brother's partner. No, 
Ah. Oh, we could move, or should we do this mission for Carl? Something personal has come up, and I should focus on it. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Is Carl going to find what's the name? Um, what's the name from The Walking Dead? She had her head cut off. Uh, from the Whisperers, what's her name? She got over Car she got over Carl really quickly and slept with her saviour. What's the what's the name? Um, she ate a turtle. Um, what was her name? In Walking Dead, what's the name? Ah. In the forefront of my brain. Talk to talk to Judith. Might get another crew out of this. It's pretty, pretty pretty cool. Thanks, bro. Glad we're finally putting this family back together. <laughs> That's so cool. <laughs> You're not coming with me, are you? Oh, you don't need to come with me. I don't want to risk you getting hurt. It's been a while since we talked. You still working on that thing? Nothing. Food. My food. My food. Oh, I need to think. I need to remember. Don't wait up. Carl. Carl's girlfriend from Walking Dead. What's the name? What's the name? Um. Ah. Um. She was really kind of pointless. The only good thing she ever did was help um, Glenn when he was underneath the dumpster. What was her name? Kept sneaking out. Um, come on, then, let's go. He'll come to me. It'd be cool to find her. Like, I think before we found her, like this. Well, we've, we've had this storyline before with um, Dwight and Sherry, <laughs> Drew and Wynn in the Sabre series. That was pretty good. Stay out of trouble though. Because I want. The thing is, I want Judith to survive because I want her to be at least the leader. If Carl dies, I don't, I'm not too fussed. Because I want a sheriff as a leader. So Judith, don't die. I wish there were more quests like this though. Like, this is really cool stuff. I like this. But the fact is that we're kind of full, and I'm kind of thinking maybe this part, there's a chance she'll probably be dead. What's the name? I've got to Google it. It's fucking pissing me off. Um. Uh. What? Oh. Um. Enid. That's it. What a stupid name. Enid, how was I ever going to remember that name? Enid. Yeah, she had her head cut off. <laughs> That's the one thing I remember. And the whispers cut her head off. Put it on a spike. And she had a turtle. It might have been a tortoise, actually. It would be nice if 
I need it. Pretty cool. That's the place I'm looking for. I'm right behind you. Oh, I see a light. Might be a chance. She might tell him, tell him to fuck off like he does, like she does in the show. <laughs> Is it dead? Chances of her being dead are quite high. I thought I saw a light. I thought I saw a torch. Come on, it'd be cool to find her. Maybe she ain't dead. Oh, hell yeah. And let's hope it ain't a dude. Dear sweets, I'm sorry I wasn't there with you when the squad. When everything went to shit, hell. I will carry the grit forever. Red Your mom didn't make the progress it. You're making out there. But she won't. She went peacefully. I'm staying at her okay. house, what hoping you you're still Where alive. I Please right come on. soon. Let's go. <laughs> hey, <laughs> so Enid was with Laurie, then? I thought she was your partner. <laughs> Different kind of partner, bro. We've got to get back. Let's home. hope it ain't a dude, though. Like, let's hope this ain't a gay situation. That that'd be a very okay. plot what twist right there. For the record, <laughs> I never liked turkey. The food, I mean. It's like chicken, only more work and more boring. As soon as I could, I cooked my own Thanksgiving meals, and I always made whatever I most wanted that day. Fucking arm. And that chick thing. Hey, not already busy. Hey, you. Enid. God, I'm tired. Man, he's so lazy. I don't think I can go much longer without a rest. Yes, you can, mate. Keep going. Cloud's a bad way to die. Get in there. I think I'd feel much safer somewhere else. Need it. Yeah. Have we got another crew today? I'm glad I found you. Let's get Thank you somewhere you, like, safe. Really. Cool. Let's hope What's she's worth for now? joining the as crew. As long as that play card is nearby, this place won't ever feel safe. Let's go. Let's do this. Here you go. Hey, hey! That's pretty cool. What about the base? Let's hope we can recruit though. I, did, I hope this ain't like a thing where it's like. That's a screamer. Better keep my. You not staying, sort of thing. <laughs> That'd be really annoying. Zombies. What kind of cool though? What's the name? Seen it though, seen it. You know, I'll forget that because <laughs> that's cool though. We found Judith, Carl, and Enid. Pretty dude. It would have been awkward if it was a dude though. Like, that would have been a really good plot twist. <laughs> that would have been proper Hollywood. Yeah, everything's gay in Hollywood now. Even the gays are gay. No problem with that, but it's just really obnoxious, like, sometimes. Who's the hunter now, huh? Fucking hell. I blew the windscreen up for a bit. Jesus. You want 
throw in with us? We can help each other. Less P. Please don't say no. Thanks for letting me on the team. Mm. Nice, cool. Got another recruit, cool. Less P. Less Frissa. Lips are P. What a stupid name. Be in it now. Police officer. Former activist. Oh, Jesus Christ. The world was full of sheep for the outbreak. Filling it with zombies haven't, hasn't changed much. Oh, fuck off, love. <laughs> Sometimes activists are bigger sheep than the actual sheep she's talking about. Um, keep the morale at 10 plus to avoid conflict. Can become frustrated. It only might. That's 20%. Okay. So she's like the one in the show. She's a bit of a bitch. So she's quite accurate to Enid in the game. In the, in the Walking Dead. Um, she's got no specific oh, skills or anything, so that's kind of good. Um, Fuck. She's got the biggest resting bitch face I've ever seen. Look at that face. <laughs> that which is a right miserable cow. <laughs> Not really. She doesn't get any happier when she's got a Christmas hat on. <laughs> I might just put a Christmas hat on just to make it look even more miserable. <laughs> uh, maybe one of these. Hmm. Yeah, let's get rid of it. But cool, we've got two recruits, we've got nine people now, ain't we? Not a bad squad. Uh, and actually, I was thinking I need to. It's probably a bad time I get rid of the Christmas look for Princess. I wanted to get the military. Get her goggles back on. There we go. And then for Negan, you could probably keep that on. It don't look too bad. It's kind of cold down here. Maybe we'll take it off during um, the next season. Well, not sit next season when we move to Providence. Not it's Providence, Trumbo Valley. Which means the Zeds are gathering around the base for an attack. So we got Enid on the team, which is kind of cool. Um, now 
Like a crossbow. Kinda need to have a crossbow usually. Especially if she, especially when we ain't got any silences. It's time we figure out who's in charge around here. Oh, that that knocked it. Damn it. Right away. You need to get better at not getting hit. Right Sometimes I just walk into That's attack so loader. easily. Yeah, she kind of needs a crossbow because we ain't got any silences. Ooh. Can you deal with the mess, guys? Good play. Uh, cool, we got Enid on the group. That's another good addition. Maybe we'll go move as well. Or we could leave that till next time. Because I wonder how we are for space now. Things around here are better than I expected. <laughs> Too right. Well, let's go and get them infestation done. Yeah, we'll leave it because it's been a pretty big episode recruiting these. I just don't know if we can count on you anymore. <laughs> oh no. We're going to leave us. We help each other out. Yeah, we help ourselves out. That's how we survive. Mm -hmm. That's how smart people survive. Can't help every single person we come across, and when we're helping them every five seconds, that's a no-go. That's a that's a red flag right there. Like helping like someone like her when she's on her own, yeah, she needs something. Oh, that's a joke. We dealt with it. God oh, damn it, guys! Leave the juggernauts alone. Oh, they've dealt with it. Oh, good. At least the watchtower does work. I didn't even realise the juggernaut was here until they said, and then it was dead. That's pretty good. I'm sure something's working in the group. We had like a real issue the other episode with two juggernauts attacking the base, but we, no, it was one, I think. But we got through it. Kinda well. Kinda need fuel. But we'll see how Enid gets on. It's kind of cool. We got the Grimes family now, technically. Like, it would be nice to find their father or something, but that's not going to happen. But Judith's probably a good fit to lead. Like, it's just trade it. Like, you think all because all these are police related. You think out of any of them? Um. They would all be sheriff related. But Wandering yeah, Judith's probably the best one to lead anyway. Be a bad idea. I think that's how she kind of recall something a bit different. Like you said, like, oh, we found a rick. Did that, did that, did that. But it's kind of nice to be able to rename, like, choose your own nicknames for characters. Well, I have chosen names. I wanted to just see before we take on that infestation. Uh, see what these go. This guy's got to trade. And I'll we'll probably end it there. I know it'll be a bit of a short episode, but I, I, I. We'll leave moving to next one, because then that's a whole new episode. We can focus on building up that base and what I actually want to do with it. Um, whereas, if I do it now, it's like, I'm not going to be building much in this episode. 
It'll be just moving and it'll be like, oh. It'll be a <laughs> different. Because I want to have this title as like, Carl finds Enid now. So that'll be what a good title. For us? Of course. Um... Not a whole lot special here. Mm. Yeah, I'm not sure. I wouldn't mind taking these, but I don't know whether I need them. Yeah, it's not too special. I feel like the aim's got back on point for AI. There's quite a f there's a few days where like the AI was definitely like struggling to hit the target. Well, they weren't hitting the targets, but they were hitting the body, which they were just knocking zombies down, not killing them. And they were like missing shots with like shotguns and stuff. It was weird. And now they seem to have got fixed. I don't know whether they did like a hot fix or something in the background, maybe. Because a few people were pointing out, and now it seems to be better. Maybe they're just looking at, because that's another thing I would like them to do before. Like, look into his hostile enclaves, like that's another thing, major thing would be nice to look at before. Like the game stops being worked on. But if anything, like, if, like hostile enclaves can be ignored, so ain't too big of a deal, but... Like that, and I would like hostile enclaves and uh, the legacy pool to be looked at. I think um, it's nice for infestation to be looked at because, like, really, I thought infestations were fine, but they were just something to do. Uh, but now, it, like, the infestations are going to be brought to Anybody the level of play counts, which is really nice. Um, they are creating some really cool work. Doing really cool work with everything. Get it, get it, get it. Oh, that zombie got fucked. <laughs> Alright, let's run them over. Let's save the Molotovs if we can. In in doubt, run them over. Old school tactic right here. How did I miss them? <laughs> that zombie's so lucky. I might have keep that one alive because she survived near death. She can live. She survived. <laughs> and Carl Ballard's like, it was just a few centimeters of her being crushed. And survived it. She dodged it. Well, I missed it, but same thing. Um, uh, I guess we could loot up this area. Honestly, I don't need the stuff yet. Like, once we start building up the big base and we start building, crafting stuff, that'll be when we need to. That's when we um, have stuff to make. Uh, like stuff to start scavenging up again, but right now, like, like this whole playthrough, I felt like I haven't needed to loot so much. I've been, I think I've been kind of lucky. I don't know why. Yeah, that's definitely felt like I haven't needed. To loot. Oh, double! <laughs> got two fellas run over. Ingredients for mash. We've got something we can use your help with. Let's go do Our this. The still is set up and ready. The only problem is we don't have anything to put in it. Yeah, let's go and do this and then we'll be pushing for, for a good hour video. I really don't agree with that plan. No, I don't give a fuck what you think. I'm going to turn around to just say, oh, I'm going to do it. Some more allies would be good. Fuck. 
Fuck. I see I, I saw him and I was about to drive into him because I thought I could just bring him over, but that's not gonna work. <laughs> Zombies spawning in on top of you. Worst thing. And that stuff, it'd be nice to kind of improve that a little bit more, but I, I don't know. I don't know if they could improve that too much because it's like. It's just the way you, the game is built, and you can kind of tell that the zombie spawning is, is just how it's going to be. Um. I thought he was hey, on fire then. Stay safe, all right? Get out of the way. We need to talk about still. We need uh, blah blah blah. Sure thing, kid. Let's do it. I'm starting to work. So, okay. That's an easy get. Are you coming with? I'm gonna get drunk again, mate. He's sick. Or get stuck on top of your stand doing nothing. Well, the fuel consumption on this is terrible. One kind of thing you get in a military truck or something. Kind of good. It'd be nice to have a whole. Careful, folks. We got a feral out here. Every vehicle we got is a military truck or something. Could be pretty cool. But there's one there. I think I saw a white one somewhere. I can't remember where though. I've been near the first area. Just start st oh, he's just oh, stood there doing nothing. I don't know if I can this. You fucking prick. Piss head. Oh, oh, I'm sorry about all this. Fight back, you piss head. Better finish it off. Dickhead. Come here, mate. Oh, now you're fighting. Look, I'm real sorry about all this. I don't give a fuck, mate. Waste of space again. In real life, I'll probably kill you. Take all your hey, stuff. I found something. And try and do it myself. Probably be better. Chances for getting it done. Well, what I would do, I would say, how are you, how are you doing? Like, learn from them, how they're setting it up, and then either once they've set up themselves, then kill them, and then just do it from our own back. Because these guys deserve, they, they deserve to get killed. They are, they are. No reason for them to keep ticking along the way they are. I think, I think there was a few episodes in The Walking Dead there was someone who drank a lot. I can't remember. I think there was something. Um, unless they have it. I don't think State of the Walking Dead is covered like people drinking. Which is kind of, it is kind of an interesting topic. Like, how would someone who is an alcoholic or... Who drinks a lot deal with the zombie apocalypse. Come on, let's go. Come on. No, I'm not saving you, mate. 
How stupid can you just go? Eat that, you ugly bastard. Guess I owe you, huh? I can't shake yes, this do. fever on my own. I need some of that cure. You ain't been bit. Uh, fuck off. Bullshit. And Wade is a follower. Uh, you thank brought you. this on. Have I cured it? I don't need a game. Oh, I've got to get played. Fuck you, mate. It's not my problem. You're the alcoholic. I know I've done this mission a ton of times, but this guy's pissing me off for some reason. I better utilize it. When I do ally with them, I need to utilize their thing a bit. <laughs> I think I've got an help. I ain't got an emperor down here. Uh, let's set up the water thing then. If we need an outpost, let's set up the I need to start my outpost anyway. We need to sit down and do that. Start. We need to either destroy every outpost we got and then build up. I think would be a good way to do it. Zombie all clear. We're good. Outpost secure and ready to go. See what we got. I think I have to make some. I don't know. Lake cure. Where are you? Whoa. Huh? Bring Wade back to his base before blood play sets in. And then they're gonna ask me for blood plague. Cure. Why can't I just give him the cure now and then he doesn't need to worry about plague sitting? We got a plague zombie over there. Don't let it get you. I kinda don't wanna give it. Shall we not give it him? I kinda think we did not give it him. Fuck him. Probably on himself. Felt like the CRM would have wasted the breath on him. Is other like if his teammates are a bit, if they know what they're doing, their team his teammates might be more useful. Cause they don't seem to be as bad as this guy. I might not cure him. Fuck him. That's terrific. If I could do with the cure myself, just in case my team gets cured. Think you're getting off this easy? No way. Talk to Josh about Wade. Oh, does he want him killed off as well? Let's do it, mate. Let's kill him off. Um, I can't believe this has happened. We're going to have to put him down unless you have any cure. I wish I did. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. I've got some in my pocket. <laughs> Put him down, put him down. Yeah, put him down. Waste of space. Thank you. Hold on, mate. Do you want to join my team? Do we more recruits? I'm going to just take his stuff if you don't mind. He owes me. Wade died. For this, make it count. And Today's the, the day we all get clean. We'll finish the still, but cool. only for medicinal purposes. Good luck out there. Come on hey. in and stay. You want to buy your stuff off me? Here you go, take your stuff. Thank you for the influence. Cool. Ah, we got, we got, we got them recruit. That's pretty. That's a good way to do that. Got rid of the waste of space. That's the thing, they got rid of the like the head blowing off. I don't like that. I remember when they used when they used to shoot the head off. Well the head used to explode. Um when you shoot shot enclaves in the end. Wow. When you euthanize someone they 
her head would explode and be really graphic. And now it seemed to not be there anymore, which is kind of a shame. It's like it was a cool visual, like, oh shit, the person you just knew's head just blew up. <laughs> but at least we got rid of the garbage. Oh my god, how did I not hit that blow that? Talking about. <laughs> But yeah, like, um, I'm happy with that decision. I was kind of hoping them, for them to say, can we join up with you? Like, I would have said, I would have took more recruits. So we are about to move to a bigger base, so... We're going to need the extra manpower. So we're kind of on the limit now. Like, if I have any more, like, we're going to struggle. But not a not bad episode today. Um, Carl found Enid with Judith, which was quite nice. Um, dealt with the alcoholics just now. Nice yeah, episode. I'm guessing nice there's a episode. Card not too far away. Um, so I think the plans for next time will probably move base to the big base. I want to try out the Haven device there once it's built up. Um, that's a drug. That drug is going to come up here, any? I can back out before they come up here. I might be good. Sup, tough guy. But yeah, we've got the Grimes family sort of thing going on because <laughs> we got Ian, uh, we got Judith, Carl, and Enid. That's pretty cool. Um, are they married? No, they're not married or anything. Oh, these guys shooting up. Gunslinging. Uh, yeah, gunslinging. Good. My weapon I know they might have been good for him because he has, like, assault rifles, but... Pretty good setup. Um, so, yeah, next time we'll just move bases. My plan is to move down here. Um... We need to sort out my outpost still, we've been putting that off for too long. And yeah, really just a good time as always. Um, so yeah, from... Well, that'll be it for State of Decay for now. Um, so tomorrow and the day after in the evenings we'll be grounded. And then we'll be back with two days of State of Decay in the evening, which will be in the next rotation. Um, and yeah, really good time as always, so just keep an eye out for the next episode. and. Yeah, really enjoying the Walking Dead theme. We're kind of getting it there with that today. Um, I love that story. I wish there were more missions like that where it's kind of family based. and It makes them characters seem like they know one another. Um, I think like, it's better than just... It's better doing stuff with the community. I wish that's why... That's another thing. I would like more missions related to the community. Like going out, relieving some stress, stuff like that. I've spoke about it before, like, I wish there were more missions that were, like, in State of Decay 1, where there were more community-based ones, where it improved morale and stuff like that, but, um, but yeah, really fun as always, I'm loving the series, um, and like I said, more, they'll be more grounded t tomorrow and the day after, um, there'll be, ma there would have been Mass Effect earlier on today, um, so check that out and yeah we'll leave it there for today so as always thanks for watching if you've been watching and i'll see you all in the next one